Well, hello friends, you're watching the Jolly Battle Experiments show. Well, what do you think if I pour water from one glass along a thread into another? The water will flow down the thread or spill? Well, let's check. <laughs> so, first tries are always a failure and it wasn't an exception for me either, but science help me this time too so in order to do this you need first of all to soak the thread in water so I have a little bit of water and I'm gonna just pour it in here and soak our thread soak it pretty good so while our water is our thread <laughs> is soaking in water we need to attach uh, one end to another and attach it to both of our cups. So now we have both ends uh, stick to the cups and now I'm going to pour water into one cup. and pour the water. And not a single wasted drop of water. Cool! So, why does water flow so obediently down the thread? This is called the capillary effect. Due to the low viscosity of water and the high Attention of water to the gaps between the fibers uh, of our thread. It gradually moves from one vessel to another. Plants obtain water by capillary action. They absorb liquid with their roots from the ground and thanks to small gaps inside the trunk, it delivers right up to the leaves and fruits. <laughs> See, that was exactly what I'm... Am I a tree? Am I growing fruits? Well, this is what we call science or magic. Science is amazing, isn't it? Well, if you want to learn more things and do magic tricks, we are waiting for you on our channel. And do not miss a single episode. See you next time.